In this episode, we will be talking about assignment operators in PHP. Assignment operators are operators that tend to do some arithmetic operation and sort the result in the same value. Your first inclination might be to think of this as setting something equal to, but that's wrong. What an assignment operator actually is, is that you want the left operand get set of the value on the expression on the right. In PHP, we've got five assignment operators. And as you can see, they all have an equal sign in it because we're going to assign it. The first one is a plus equal to, which means add and assign. Second one is minus equal, which is subtract and assign. The third one is multiply assign. A fourth one is divide and assign. And the fifth one is concatenate and assign. So let's create a variable and name it variable x and set it equal to 5. So let's say that you want to add another 5 to variable x. The way you could write it down and you probably should do is saying variable x is equal to variable x plus 5. Let's save it. Let's echo out variable x. Refresh the browser and the output is 10. Programmers tend to be lazy, and just for an addition, this is too much code. Let's restructure the second line of code that we have. And let's say that we have variable x, and we want to add and set it equal to variable x plus 5. Let's save it. Refresh the browser and the output is exactly the same as before. And you can see how much less code this actually is. So let's change the plus sign to a minus. 5 minus 5 is equal to 0. And if we multiply it, the output is 25. We could also divide it, which will be equal to 1. You could also add an assignment operator in the echo statement. So let's say that we have the 1 because we're defining it by 5 again, I want to plus set it equal to 5, which is equal to 6, because we have our 1 plus equal 5 is 6. The last assignment operator that we have is concatenate and assign. This cannot be done with two variables of data integer. So let's create a new variable called variable x and set it equal to 10. Well, you can concatenate with two integers, but the output will most likely not be what you expect. So let's test it out. Let's say that we want to echo out variable x and we want to concatenate with variable y. Let's save it, refresh the browser, and the output is 6, 10. The 10 is basically pasted right behind the 6. So let's remove the echo. Let's also remove the y variable, and let's create a new variable called string and set it equal to Dari is an old man. So let's write down string again, and let's follow it by a punctuation mark and an equal sign. Now let's add a piece of code right behind it. Dari is an old man because he is 24 years old. Let's echo out string, let's save it, refresh the browser, let's also add a break. And you can see that it just became one beautiful long sentence. This was it for this episode. If you do enjoy my content and you want to see more, leave this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button.